Hello, and welcome to SFN at 6 o'clock. I'm your anchor, Jacob Solis. Our top story tonight, C8. C8? In Georgetown. Where will he strike next? Reports have come into our studio that C8 has been once again spotted in Georgetown. We go live to our reporter in the field, Logan McKenzie. Logan? Logan McKenzie, at San Gabriel Park. Today we are looking for C8 that escaped from Bastrop Zoo about two weeks ago. It was spotted here over the past week from various tourists around the area. We're here today with John McRawley, top sea ape hunter in the tri-state area. Tell us a little about yourself, John. I hunt sea apes. And how exactly do you hunt the sea ape? I can find what he is by the smell of his fear. The smell of his fear? I didn't know a person could smell fear. How, do you, how, does, that, how does that work, sir? You can you can tell by the way the sun hits the, the ground and then reflects off the ground and hits the trees that that turns into the fear or the smell of the fear at night time. I see. So you usually hunt sea apes at night? No, they they come out whenever they want to. So you always gotta be ready because sea ape could just you know come out. So how many sea apes have you caught in the past? I've caught near around 20 sea apes all over the world. 20 sea apes? Now, they're pretty elusive creatures. That's quite an accomplishment. Mm. So, let me, so let's hear about a little bit about your gun that you're going to be using to hunt the sea ape today. Oh yeah, this is Senorita Gingita. We've been together for a long time. And um, how long exactly have you had Senorita Gingita? All my 20 sea ape kills. Wait, one more second. Anything? I mean, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I heard something. No, 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 no. If there was a sea ape here, I'd know it. You know it? I know it. I can tell. Okay. There's no sea ape there. Well, anyways, back to what we were talking about. What were we talking about? Um, let's see. Killing sea apes. Killing sea apes. So I hear you have armor-piercing rounds armor today. Yes. To use the gorilla has a uh, armor fur, so you gotta use armor-piercing rounds to kill the gorilla. Armor piercing. Yeah. Sounds pretty intense. Mm. So I wish you all the luck in finding the sea today. Oh, thanks. Won't be too hard. Now, experts say that a dying sea ape mother traveled her way from Bastrop and laid her eggs in San Gabriel Park. The recent floods that we've had carried them away and they hatched into what we have now, more sea apes. From an anonymous source, we've come across an, a sea ape birthing video. This is truly remarkable footage. <laughs> Incredible. Well, that's all the time we have for tonight. Thank you for watching. Sausage Fest News at 6. I'm your anchor, Jacob Solis. Stay classy, Georgetown. Hello. Today. Nope, I messed up. Okay. Thank you, Travis. This is Lowell McKenzie. It escaped it. So just start over when you do it like that. The person hog! What the hell? That resonated in Bass Drop. See, they've carried our CA pop. Damn it! Bass Drop means stay. The foot that stayed in Bass Drop carried it. I don't know. It made it sound smart. Earthquake! Oh. 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 Oh.